Yeah. I think it's maintain the peace. Oh, Zoha. 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 My, Zoha. My sister, yeah. She's very calm. And I but feel like... Like, 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 both of us have the same kind of attitude. He's become a lot better since he joined. It's calmed down. I still yeah, have a long way to go. He's not doing much. He's very calm. He wasn't like that. I think his calm has calmed down. Kar liya. I'm the nice one. So troubleshooting yeah. or whatever. If anyone yeah. in the company has any problem, they come to me. Yeah. I can be hot-headed. Which also, this new trend has started that now they think since he's that nice, every single person is going to go complain about us to him. <laughs> and I'm like, what is going on? What is this complaint session? Why do they reach out to you that Daniel, bhai, aap dekh lenge, please, ma'am, ansab, ma'am, zoha, ye kai, you know, like, so he's that nice that people think that they can just go to him and have a solution to it. Yeah, about, about us also. Even, even apart from HR, everything is just so challenging because, uh, we have multiple collections throughout the year. So we just opened up two retail stores, uh, one in 2021 and yeah. then the other one uh, in Lahore starting at uh, at the starting of 2022. I know, I've, I've went yeah, there. Yeah, we, we you have covered it also. I've covered us. it also. Yeah. So, so opening the stores isn't a challenge. Obviously, that's a challenge in itself. But filling the stores and then, you know, meeting your like global demand through your e-commerce platforms. Uh, that was something that we initially struggled with. Production. Production. Yeah, it, it totally changes, right? Yeah. Because yeah. uh, when you Also, based... we were a very made to, I'm sorry, I'm calling yeah. you out, but we were a very made to order brand. Exactly. Initially, it was not ready to wear. Mm. So from that shifting to a ready to wear brand, also not being able to comprehend the type of demand our clothes had was quite overwhelming. And for us to kind of match that has taken time. So now it's like if a collection is coming out, it has to be in stores. It has to be online. It has to be like shipped in time. That kind of, uh, you know, process has become has be distributed, like challenging. Yeah. yeah. And right now, I feel like this year is the toughest for most of the designers because there is Eid, Ramadan and Lawn together. Yeah. There is absolutely no time. So it's back to back. It can hit one collection uh, or it can be great. So both are zyada stressful. Ho gaya. Um, planning three collections, which are actually the biggest collections of the year for every brand, yeah. I would say. So that has been... Now we're it's having gonna get smaller a and smaller yeah. gap is going to keep shrinking. shrinking, that, shrinking. I think next year is going to be more like difficult. We're having Eid sleepless nights like, already. Uh, yeah. um, lawn Eid and lawn will, will be together. So yeah. It might just be well, like. It might be easier. I and mean, those two are really like, you know, like anticipated yeah. collections for us, yeah. so I would say. I don't know about the others, but like, you know, they have separate contribution to the yearly targets also that we have to meet. So I would like them to be separate. Mm. Overlapping might obviously dilute mm. like sales and it would just be one collection then. But I guess it is what it is. So, Okay, so you have three collections now coming out. So Lawn came out on the 7th yeah, of correct. March. Yeah. And uh, your pre-booking was on the 2nd. Yes. And now you have an Eid and Ramadan is also out, I believe. Yeah, so Ramadan actually came before Lawn okay. on the 24th of Feb. And then that was followed by our Lawn. And which was very overwhelming. It was a fantastic event. And it was like surreal. We couldn't like believe Response it. was phenomenal. Response yeah. was phenomenal. Before we even launched, it was madness. And then it's Eid that we're all still taking orders on because that was just launched on March 10th. So that's the festive collection that we're working on. It's back to back. Oh, literally, like managing this. It's all literally I'm a week apart. Yeah. Yeah. I'm thinking about the amount that you guys have to do. Yeah. No, imagine uh, the, the stress that we're going through because three three collections ki ek saath we have to get production done, right? Yeah. So it's crazy. And the I mean, volumes are crazy. We've so. had sleepless nights. Uh, yeah. I think the past two, three weeks, Zohan and I and Ansar, we haven't slept. Yeah. That is so, nuts. Because there's, there's just so much on the line that uh, not in just terms of production, but marketing, getting everything out. Ansab actually, basically Ansab handles the social media and the design aspect of the business. So she, she's probably, I think, online 24 hours a day. Yeah, I have to like obviously make sure that, you know, all the collections are rolled out at the right time 